Life Stallions, what's up? Tina Barber here, back with another video. Today's video is gonna be on a new Stylecraft X-Pro Precision Blade. Now, before we get into this blade, you already know what to do, guys. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Also, give the video a thumbs up if you like the content, and follow me on my Instagram page, at Kimmy Lifestyle. So without further ado, let's roll that intro. Welcome back to the channel guys. So we're talking about the new Stylecraft X Precision Blade. Now this is a blade that I just got in. I've been trying it out, using this blade on my clients, and I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts and opinion about this blade. So let me show you what the blade looks like. So the great thing about Stylecraft Gamma is that all their blades fit on their trimmers. I ended up putting the X-Pro blade on the Sabre trimmer, which is my favorite trimmer. I think that it complements this trimmer very well because this trimmer is a brushless motor, which is very powerful. And then having this blade on here, which is very sharp, just complements each other. You're able to get sharp lines and you can still bald out your clients even though this is a smaller blade. So this blade will remind you of the Slimline Pro Blade, which is gonna be this blade right here. So these two blades are pretty much the same size, the same width. And the Stemline Pro is one of those trimmers that I always have on my station. Sometimes you get clients with a smaller vertical bar right here. And when you have a longer blade, you take a chance on nicking their eyebrows or making their vertical bar a little bit longer than they would like. And so I always keep one of these Slimline Pros. And what I do is I don't zero gap it all the way because I end up using this on kids. So this is like not sharp at all. The trouble with me having this is because again, having all the different chargers and stuff on my station. I like to be able to use my clippers and trimmers using the same um, charging dock, the same plugs, and it just makes it so much easier. That way I don't have a bunch of plugs at my station. And that's the reason why I use a lot of the Stylecraft Gamma products. I'm able to interchange, especially with their adapters. They all fit all their clippers and trimmers. And it's just, I can get a real nice flow with this. So with me having the Slimline Pro, I will have the charger with this. And it's just, again, just extra chargers that I don't want on my station. Although I do love this trimmer. It is a great trimmer, guys. Don't get me wrong. So here's me using the two blades on one of my clients just to give you guys a little demonstration on how strong having that brushless motor compared to the Slimline motor. I'm not even sure what motor the Slimline Pro is. If you guys know, get in that comment section and let me know because I'm not even sure the motor on the Slimline Pro. But I do know this brushless motor is a lot stronger. And as you can see, when I'm using the Slimline Pro versus the Sabre trimmer with the new X-Pro blade on there, and you can see the difference. I think that the new X-Pro blade is a lot smoother. I would say this, be careful when you are zero gapping it because of that titanium and also that black carbon fiber blade can be very sharp, guys. So I had to mess around with it a little bit before I really started using it on my clients. Although this blade is small, it can be very sharp if you're not zero gapping your tools correctly. So I recommend you not to zero gap it too much. It's actually a good blade to use right out the box. You don't even have to zero gap it. I wish I would have just left it the way it was. It's just a bad habit of me. I'm just right out the box. I like to zero gap my stuff, my clippers and my trimmers. I gotta remember to tell myself to not do that anymore. Just try to use it as it is. If you have a light hand and you want to zero gap a little bit closer, you can do that as well. I'm just warning you guys, this, this blade is very sharp. So pricing on the new X-Pro Precision Blade is gonna run you around $39 on the Stylecraft website. I will leave that link in the description below. If you guys wanna order one and make sure you use code KING and save you some money, guys. So of course we have to crown our trash, this new Stylecraft X-Pro Precision Blade. And of course, guys, we gotta crown this blade. So the way I do it, guys, I had to double up on my Sabre trimmers and I have the regular X-Pro blade and then I have the smaller X-Pro blade. And what I'm able to do is, when I have those shorter vertical bars, I'm doing designs, I'm gonna use this trimmer and then just for my regular lineups, I'm gonna use my wider blade. I think having both of the blades 
will be a great combination to have on your station. So in my next video, we're gonna talk about the new Gamma Blade. It's called the Wide X Pro Blade. And this is gonna be a blade from Gamma, of course. Now they also have a really great blade as well. And we're gonna dive into that on my next video. So that's gonna be a wrap on today's video. Hope you guys enjoy the content. You know what to do. Please guys, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoy the content. Get in that comment section. Let me know what you guys think about the new Stylecraft X-Pro Precision Blade. So until then, I'll see you guys on the next video.